as the clutches wait to go in there in and a beautiful start by Hughes at the front of the field a little bit slow away there Oliver Gavin didn't make perhaps the best of starts in they come the first two pulling out a little bit quite a pack behind somebody gets sideways that looked like Christian Horner and everybody in fact going everywhere you can possibly imagine in trouble in the middle of that was Werner Lutberger through Church, Brooklands, up Wooden Hill, towards Club. And Warren Hughes in charge, behind him, worrying at his heels there, Gavin. And behind Gavin is James Matthews, and then Castro Neighbors in third place on the blue car. And this quartet have pulled out quite a lead from the opposition, led currently by number nine, Gulta Salas. Across the line they come for the first time. And you could say, I think, with a degree of certainty that the sort of advantage that they have is going to take some closing down by anybody else. So Hughes where he expected to be. Warren Hughes, definitely the man to watch as in goes the unfortunate Ralph Furman, who was involved in that incident. Here's the leader once more, with, of course, slower cars to be dealt with before this race is over. And right on the ragged edge there, as into the pits comes 17, Gonzalo Rodriguez. And the three leaders on the back of the circuit, coming up now, once again, towards club corner. Warren Hughes, slower car in front, Dad Abu Bay, the Arabian driver, and he shuts the door on Hughes, and Hughes lost all his advantage there. He's right off cam, and this could be the chance that Gavin's waiting for. If Gavin was able to anticipate that, he's right with him now.